for St. Francis Healthcare's House Calls TV. Every woman needs a pap smear, which is an important screening tool in the fight against cervical cancer. Dr. Kanasha Gleaton explains when and how often a woman needs to get one. In December of 2009, the American College of OBGYN said that a woman should not have her first pap smear until the age of 21, regardless of her sexual activity. A woman should have a pap smear at least every two years, and that's the most cost-effective regimen. However, some women feel that they should go more frequently or they're afraid that they, if they space out their screenings that they'll forget. So certainly we do see women on an annual basis. The pap smear can find abnormal cervical cells, the kind that could turn into cancer in the future. This allows doctors to perform further tests for the women who are at highest risk. Don't miss it. You know, it's, it's a shame. Anytime I diagnose a cervical cancer, I really feel that it was opportunity loss because it's one of those things that are so preventable. I think most OBGYNs, certainly us at Harborside, we strive to make sure that first exam is comfortable. Cervical cancer should not happen in the United States. For more information, call 402 CARE. And for more House Calls TV, go online to rsfh.com. I'm Angela May. Roper St. Francis Healthcare's House Calls TV.